What's up guys, Curated Expert Charlotte here. Just got done ripping on the Blizzard Black Pearl 88s. Just so you know, we're not sponsored by any brand, so all of our reviews are completely unbiased. If you like this video, click subscribe to watch more videos like this from Curated Experts. Let's go ski. These are super fun on the groomers. Short turn radius, really loopy, propel you from one turn to the next. They have a pretty gentle rocker camber, but they hold an edge really well. They're constructed with the True Blend Carbon Flip Core, which keeps them really poppy, really energetic. So I took these on the groomers to start. Really nice, short and medium radius turns, really fun, really energetic, really poppy, really playful. Then we ventured off into some more packed powder moguls. They did really well in some chalky stuff. They're, they got a little bit choppy when things got more firm underfoot, but for the most part, they're really maneuverable and nimble through bumps. These skis would be really, really fun for the beginner, intermediate to advanced female skier who's looking to spend most of their time on groomers and maybe bounce and weave between bumps and trees. For someone who puts a ton of forward pressure into their ski, they might feel a little bit less stable underfoot for you, but they really rip on groomers. And if turning medium radius or short radius turns is your style, then they're gonna be really fun for you. They're also 88 underfoot, so they're a good choice for someone who's East Coast and looking to make those short radius turns on a groomer. If you spend more time out West, they might be a little bit narrow. They're not gonna have crazy great float through powder, but Blizzard makes the Black Pearls in 97 as well, so that'll give you a little extra flotation if you like the construction of this ski, but you want a little extra width. So I'm a skier who likes, who puts a lot of forward pressure into their skis and really likes to rail a carve. So they did really well for me. I had to hold back a little bit because I tend to really be on the tip, on the, on the fronts of my skis and the fronts of my boots. So they were a little less stable for me than, than my go-to daily driver. But I think for someone who has, puts a little bit less energy into their ski or is working on learning to carve, they're gonna be a really nice option for you. The 88s underfoot are gonna be really nice for a firmer day or for a firmer snowpack at your mountain. If you're looking to split your time between east and west coast and you need a ski that's gonna hold up better in powder or give you a little extra flotation, the 97s are definitely gonna be your daily driver, your go-to. That's a really approachable width where you can still rail carves on groomers and then you can jump in and out of some fluffier snow too. These skis are really good for um, something that's more packed and something that you are not looking to get much flotation out of. I think this ski is really, really approachable for a huge range of skiers. For someone who's just learning to ski, these skis are gonna lend themselves well to helping you learn how to get into a curve. With They have a, a nice amount of rocker here, which is gonna help with turn initiation. But then underfoot, they have camber, which is gonna help you hold your carve and work on executing that carve. So they're a really approachable ski for a beginner. And then once you improve, once you start excelling, they're gonna be the ski that you're still reaching for every single day because they're really durable. They feel fun underfoot. They don't feel like they're too weak for someone who is advancing from a beginner to intermediate and even into that advanced category. They're your ski that you're gonna have for seven years. And then when it's time to replace them, you might just buy Black Pearls again. And don't forget, if you want help finding a setup that's perfect for you, click the link below in the description and you'll get matched up with me or an expert like me and we'll get you all set up for this winter.